For this sunglasses case I'm going to use this lovely fabric which I found, um, my lining piece. Both I've cut out at 20 centimetres square, so 20 centimetres by 20. This is 20 by 20. And a piece of double sided fusible foam. This is 18 centimetres by 18. And on one side I've cut out a notch to make it easier to get your glasses in and out. So just fold the foam in half and then cut out um, a little space to put your glasses in and out. Now this I'm going to now fuse. Oh yeah, I've got some tassels here and some jump rings which I've attached. And I'll attach you that, the others when I put it to the zip. So on my lining I'm going to place this like that. Carefully turn it over and just iron that. It's a this is a double sided um, foam, this one, but you can use any. Um, and because it's quite thick, I found that the heat doesn't go through and stick it to my ironing mat. So this will just stick it on one side. Like that. If you have a directional fabric like I have, see, flowers all going in one direction, you need to make sure you cut it the right way up and um, when you sew it to the lining make sure you've got it facing the right direction. So this is my top, this is the top, turn it over, right sides together and I'm going to sew all the way around leaving about a four inch gap on one side so I can turn it the right way up and cutting this as well. So I'm going to sew this and I'll show you what to do next. So I've sewn around as you can you might be able to see white stitching there. Um, so I'm just going to trim this and cut around here. Just trim around the corners, make sure you don't cut into your stitching. So if you do try and make this, let me know how you get on. Um, just write, send in your pictures, send in your comments and just trim around here. Don't cut into your stitching of course. And now uh, for the moment of truth, let's see if this works. So there you have it. So all you need to do now is just close up this opening in there by doing a, a top stitch all the way around. So there's your finished
So all you need to do now is fold this in half and um, top stitch down the long side and the short side. Thank you. 